Kilo Kilo 4, Tango X-Ray Juliet. Kilo Kilo 4, Tango X-Ray Juliet, Roger. Kilo Kilo 4, Tango X-Ray Juliet, Roger. That's a Roger. And I, I have a new headset, headset with a microphone. I need to set the settings for it. Yeah, you're pretty distorted. So um, I will say uh, the first thing, what radio are you running, sir? So um, I will say uh, the first thing, what radio are you running, sir? Uh, uh, let me turn the volume down, uh, the gain. Hold on one second. Is that any better? It's still garbled. Uh, it's still garbled. What, what, uh, you take that mic level down to about 40%. Take it down to about 40% and we'll work it from there. Okay, is this any better? It's getting there. Now, uh, what radio are you running? Hello, testing. It's getting there. Now, uh, what radio are you running? Uh, I'm running a uh, Yazoo FTA 57. Uh, slowly, try it again. Uh, slowly, try it again. Uh, this is KK4 TXJ. I'm running a Yazoo FG857. And my microphone gain is at 40 right now. Okay. Uh, what I suggest that uh, you first you get that uh, compressor in line at about a 3. We have a tune up, uh, generic tune up procedure. It starts with you uh, bringing your compressor online at a 3. It's just a token amount, but it does exactly what it needs to do. So, compressor at a 3. Exactly what it needs to do. So, compressor at a 3. Okay, the compressor goes from 0 to 100 uh, on this radio. I presume a 30% maybe? Yes, sir, 30%. We just want a third of its capabilities. Yes, sir, 30%. We just want a third of its capabilities. Okay, processor is coming on. Okay, uh, I need uh, about 10 seconds of you uh, uh, talking about maybe your antenna system so I can see if I can find a better path, Roger. About maybe your antenna system so I can see if I can find a better path, Roger. Okay, this is KK10 and it's 20% at a 20 foot pole with an inverted, homemade inverted V with a 40 meter wire and an 80 meter wire. Over. All right, now uh, if, go to your ALC meter with the mic gain in hand and adjust your ALC meter to where it's reading mid scale to two thirds by way of uh, adjusting your mic gain, Roger. Two thirds by way of uh, adjusting your mic gain, Roger. Okay, let's see what happens. It's uh, about, uh, nah, 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 nah. let me see, it, uh, it just quit. It, okay, there it goes. It's uh, almost. Uh, Alrighty, uh, what's the name there, please? Alrighty, uh, what's the name there, please? My name is George. I'm located in Georgia, close to Athens, Georgia. Roger, well, that's why you're doing so well on the uh, Georgia SDR. <laughs> we have one that actually works. Usually, when you have an SDR in the same state the person is, you can't hear them. I don't know what that is all about. But uh, anyway, so uh, uh, tell me uh, the best thing you like about uh, your radio. Yeah, tell me uh, the best thing you like about uh, your radio. It's fairly easy to use. It's, um, it, it forgives uh, high SWRs when I'm tuning it up. It, it, it doesn't choke on the high SWRs when I'm tuning it, but uh, uh, I do use a tuner uh, for the other bands, and uh, that, that's pretty much it. it. It works pretty well. I'm happy with it. Roger. So right now you're running uh, just the uh, radio 100 watts. Is that a Roger? Okay, it sounds like I'm hearing just a little bit of distortion, and I'm not sure why that would be if you're, uh, again, um, verify that your uh, 
your ALC level is uh, running mid-scale to two-thirds. Uh, sometimes if you exceed the speed limit on your ALC, it, you will uh, get that kind of peak distortion. But uh, so uh, come back and uh, talk to me for a minute. And uh, as you're talking, just uh, uh, adjust that ALC meter uh, again for mid-scale to two-thirds by way of your mic gain control. Again for mid-scale to two-thirds by way of your mic gain control. Roger, it looks like uh, you're about uh, 3 dB noise. Your your uh, dynamic range is about 3 dB at this point, so that's exactly where you want to be. Uh, 3 dB dynamic range uh, averages out to uh, 80 to 85 percent average uh, peak modulation, so that would be perfect. Now, uh, did you say you you have a high standing wave on your antenna, and you're using your your antenna tuner to uh, bring that within reason? Do you have any idea where it is uh, without the antenna tuner? Have you looked at it without the antenna tuner? It is uh, without the antenna tuner. Have you looked at it without the antenna tuner? I think it's about one to one and a half. Oh, that's not bad at all. That's not a problem. So uh, I was thinking if you had high SWR, it uh, could be that would uh, be causing your distortion. There's not a lot of it, but uh, I can hear some, you know, and you'll be able to hear it uh, when you uh, check out your uh, audio, Roger. Well, you, you want it in line, but only at about a 30%, which would be a 30 out of 100 if it has uh, that uh, mar marking, Roger. 100 if it has uh, that uh, mar marking, Roger. Roger. Uh, it's at, uh, only the 31 only plays the 30, exactly. Uh, okay, that, that's 30 now. Uh, it shouldn't make much difference, I wouldn't think. Roger, uh, just pop it out for a minute. Pop the uh, compressor out and let me hear you uh, without it. Uh, give me about 10 seconds or something uh, with the compressor out. Uh, give me about 10 seconds or something uh, with the compressor out. Okay, this is with no compressor and the ALC is uh, going up a little higher, I think it looks like anyway. Uh, so there you go. Yeah, I could hear the. I could hear. I could see your dynamic range uh, get even smaller. So you were driving your ALC uh, uh, pretty hard there. So I would keep that compressor in line. I would uh, back off another. Uh, uh, what's your uh, mic level at the moment? Uh, back off another. Uh, uh, what's your uh, mic level at the moment? Uh, mic level is at thirty-five percent. Roger, I would pull that to uh, 30%, and then I would back off that mic uh, about uh, an additional inch or, t or so. Off that mic uh, about uh, an additional inch or, t or so. Uh, what was the first thing you said, 30%? Uh, no, uh, just uh, about 5%. Uh, take off uh, about 5% of the gain of where you are, and then uh, in addition to that, back off your mic about, a, about another inch. Back off your mic about a about another inch. Okay, I didn't have the mic pretty close to my mouth. This is now thirty percent, which is five percent less than it was. Roger, I think it's sounding better. Again, I I did not have a real a sterling copy on you at that particular point, but I think uh, uh, I think that's going to be better. Now, what uh, which mic was that again? Uh, now, what, uh, which mic was that again? Uh, I bought a new uh, uh, headset. Okay, uh, Mother Nature got you that time. Try it again. Uh, what kind of mic is that? Mother Nature got you that time. Try it again. Uh, what kind of mic is that? 
I bought it from a ham, ham guy, ham radio guy, W2 something, I forget. He, he makes these earphones, headsets with a boom microphone, and he sells an adapter cable for your, for your radio with it. Okay, are you running any kind of uh, outboard audio equipment or just the, the microphone going directly into the radio? Equipment or just the, the microphone going directly into the radio? No, nothing outboard, no, nothing. All right, so it does sound like something's being pushed. Uh, what, uh, again, is your mic level specifically at the moment? Uh, what, uh, again, is your mic level specifically at the moment? It's at 30%, three zero. Roger. Well, I think it's better than what it was. Uh, you can be the judge when you uh, uh, check out your audio, Roger. Uh, you can be the judge when you uh, uh, check out your audio, Roger. Okay, um, you want me to try the uh, processor again? Okay, uh, is the processor in or out? Okay, uh, is the processor in or out? It's out right now. Okay, seems to be uh, stabilizing a, a little bit uh, with it in, so I would put that uh, that compressor in and just leave it at a 30, uh, just leave it in at a 30, which we should be about a third of its capabilities, Roger. 30, which we should be about a third of its capabilities, Roger. Okay, it's at 30, the processor is on now and it's at 30%, and the mic gain is 30%. Roger, Roger, and uh, yeah, you're looking at your ALC meter, and uh, uh, tell me what it's reading. You're looking at your ALC meter, and uh, yeah, tell me what it's reading. Okay, right now it's, uh, it's a little lower than it was without the processor on it. It's not going up nearly as high as it was. Okay, so in, in that particular radio, I'm going to suggest that you run that radio at uh, mid-scale. Uh, try to keep that uh, because it does sound like a peak uh, peak audio dis distortion. So I would keep that uh, ALC meter running uh, just at uh, mid scale, Roger. ALC meter running uh, just at uh, mid scale, Roger. Okay, let me. Uh, okay, let me see. It's uh, not quite there yet. Not right. Not quite there right now. Well. If I uh, speak up a little bit, it is, yeah. Okay, so now you're just running mid-scale on the radio, uh, on the AOC meter? Okay, so now you're just running mid-scale on the radio, uh, on the AOC meter? Uh, barely, barely, yeah. Yeah, it does sound like you do have a little bit of distortion, but I'm not sure exactly where it's coming from. But anyway, uh, if you listen to your audio, I think you could hear it. Maybe we could, uh, you know, um, try it next uh, Friday. You might be able to play around with it a little bit, uh, uh, you know, and listen to your audio. Uh, see if uh, you can find out where that distortion's coming from. It, um, you know, it sounds almost like uh, input mic uh, overload. It just sounds like that. There's a distortion on the peaks, and um, you know I'm sure that uh, you were down there 30, 35 or something on mic level. So I wouldn't, you know, think uh, that uh, you, you know, that mic would be overdriving anything. You know, if uh, if you were down around 10% uh, or 5% mic level, <laughs> then uh, you know I would say that mic is just uh, extremely hot going into it, but you're up there around 30% or so, so, uh, you know, uh, I think that mic is just uh, doing, you know, average uh, situation, Roger. That mic is just uh, doing, you know, average uh, situation, Roger. Okay, uh, I need to look, uh, I'll see if I can get somebody to record me and play me back. Roger, Roger. Well, let me say uh, three to you. I think we've uh, probably about uh, done as best we can. I think you're running at that uh, less uh, uh, audio uh, mic level uh, is helping, and also with that uh, that compressor in, I think that's uh, helping uh, keep things under control as far as uh, uh, minimizing the uh, peaks and the, the distortion associated with the peaks. So uh, three to you.
uh, sir and uh, George, and uh, if you get a chance, uh, you know, uh, we will be posting this within the next couple of days. So if you go to YouTube and do a call letter search for Kilo Charlie 9, Victor Kilo Victor, that will take you to our QSO VLAG page. You'll be looking for an ent entity called My Group Air Check 51520. Today's date, My Group Air Check 51520. Roger. It's my group air check. My group air check. A recording, Roger. A recording, Roger. My group air check. Roger. That uh, air check is, is uh, a euphemism for uh, a recording made off the air, Roger. Made off the air, Roger. Okay, I got it. Thank you very much for your help. Roger, Roger, George. That sounded pretty good right there. Uh, three Steve, sir. Have a great uh, afternoon, beautiful weekend. Uh, this is uh, Kilo Charlie 9, Victor, Kilo Victor. The uh, QSO VLOG net, if you've got a radio you want to check out, give me a shout.